Denver Broncos Mile High View, no commercials, never any bullshit over here. So uh, I have the bucket man who's in transit right now. Uh, we just got word, and it's really music to our ears. It's one of those about time moments. And uh, Bucket Man made a, a film study on Sean Payton. And there's a certain crowd out there that wants to reinvent Sean Payton into their image. And we said, no, this is important that we try to keep as much. Uh, we, we hired a guy. Let's keep it within his system as much as we can and tweak it where necessary, but not reinvent it. Uh, that video, I'll link it, is going gone viral uh, with uh, the film study of Sean Payton's offense, and we highlight the offensive line. Uh, and and before I get into that, I just want to say one thing. We just got done with the Sean Payton press conference, and I am happy to report so far, we take it one step at a time, we're not going to get ahead of ourselves, but we didn't hear the sandbox um, speech I was expecting. Oh, all the players, they, oh, they're everything I ever wanted. Uh, that's why I'm here. We don't have to get rid of anybody. They're, you know, uh, they're, Sean Payton's talk about, uh, Sean Payton and George Payton are talking about uh, building. So, so far, so good. But this really, really sent us over the top. Uh, uh, Bucket Man, why don't you go ahead and break the news? Well, the Denver Broncos hired assistant offensive line coach Zach Strife. This guy, I am so fucking happy that we got a guy of his caliber. A lot of people don't know who he is. He is a power gap centric offensive line coach. He didn't go out and get Mark Schlereth. He didn't go out and get Mike Munchek. You went and got a guy that fits the offensive line that Sean Payton wants, hopefully. I want to see who they hire as offense coordinator, so on and so forth. But the key is they didn't go out and get an offense coordinator. They went out and got an offense alignment. I am, and also in this the press number one hire, the very first yeah, hire. Yeah, the one. very first offensive hire. Offensive line. Very first, Thank you. Yes. yes the God. very first hire. Eight it took years. You eight fucking years. years. Thank you. It took you eight fucking years. You finally, now, now, let's not get ahead of ourselves. I know. Let's not get too excited. I want to see what they do. On, I mean, this is encouraging, and they didn't use the word. The player personnel is great. They said build, 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 build. Yes. Yes. Go ahead. Exactly. That is very encouraging. The hire is encouraging. Uh, now I'd like to see later on maybe bring in a Camara, not Elliot. You do not want Elliot. Get a Camara type player, number 10 in Kansas City, not because you want to be Kansas City, because you want to be the Sean Payton offense that everybody, you know, has known and loved and the reason you brought him in here. Am I correct? It, yes, you are. You are absolutely correct on that assessment. And I just I, I want to see the same vision on the defensive side as we're going to see on the offensive side. OK, I mean, I, I hope. This, OK, go ahead. Go ahead. No, I, I just I, we we need to have a same vision from the top down, organizational wise, and I, I just I want to see an offensive coordinator that implements what Sean Payton wants to do offensively, and I want to see a, de a, de a defense coordinator slash D line coach, all the above, that emulates what Sean Payton wants to do defensively. I do not want to have all. You don't want to have a mismatch of of systems and coaches trying to do you know create something that doesn't make any sense so i think we just lost the bucket man uh he's in transit uh so anyway this was good news i'll give him and see if he comes back in a minute if not we'll just hang up on it but yeah good news broncos are actually and you know what i was going to say is maybe just maybe uh <sighs> Maybe just maybe that Elway or that, uh, excuse me, Sean Payton and George Payton can finally get rid of that Elway slash trust um, L stench that's in the buildings. Maybe, maybe, maybe. It's, it's, you know, I know it's a lot to ask for that, but hopefully they can start doing this the right way. Yes. And I think, yes. oh, you're back. Back. Okay. Yes. Okay, great. So hopefully, yeah. uh, it's a great start. Anything else? 
No, I'm just happy that the first hire was an O-line coach. That oh. is a power that is a power gap centric O-line coach. I am just ecstatic, ecstatic maybe, for that. I'm happy. Maybe Sean Payton, maybe people around him saw this and like, yeah, <laughs> we need it. All yeah, right. And, but and, yes. and, and they you're the only yeah. person with common sense out there. Yeah, that puts because I fucking watch film. Because I watch film and I don't go with the bullshit. And I, I'm really hoping Peyton gets back to He's talked about film. I really hope this is a film-centric coaching staff, uh, GM-centric, film-centric coaching staff. Forget the analytics unless they have, unless... You put the context behind the stats, the stats don't mean shit. We're not using stats to make the front office look better than they really are. Let's actually do this right, right? Yes, let's roll up our sleeves and do this the right way, please. Well, this is a very encouraging sign, and this is probably the most excited you've probably ever seen us on this channel. So, hope yes, 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 because they went out and got an O-line coach that – it's what Sean Payton wants to do on the offensive line. Now, I want to see if they, if he has the power to get the O line players that he can to fix this O line. That 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 is my next thing I gotta look forward to. I mean, I, I want the same vision offensively. You can't go out and get an offense coordinator that runs a West Coast scheme. You need to go out and get an offense coordinator, whether it's from the Saints or whoever, that runs the power gap centric system with spread concepts. Yeah, and and I hope I I like I said I, the problem is is the Broncos are are, are strapped with yes. sex cap. They I they've got to move. They've got to move probably Russell's contract, but they pro, they've got to get rid of these players that been these oversigned players. They've got to start liquidating. Yes, they got to start liquidating. And another thing that was encouraging too, my the last thing I thought. Is the building process and how hard they're going to work and not cater to the fucking media. Thank you. Yeah, yes, they did say that. We're, yes, yes we're gonna, they cater to yes, me. Yes, we're going to be yes, hard on them. Yes. Like yes. Thank yes, you. Oh, Absolutely. Thank you, Sean Payton. Thank, I mean, uh, thank you. I am. That is music to my fucking ears. Absolutely. Well, we'll see if this trend continues. I at least you know maybe. Maybe the ownership group, I told you where egos are involved, maybe that tap, tap, tap is gone. The Elway tap, the Elway tap, I'm not, tap. I'm not going to go there right okay, now. Okay, okay. Let's not get too far ahead. Let's take yes. it one, yeah. one higher at a time. See what, yes, what. They got, yes, the, this is, like I said, this is the most encouraging sign since they got Mike Munchak on the, I mean, there we go. Now, now let's get. Now let's start getting people that have the same vision in that coaching staff and the front office. Please. I'd like to see scouts. I want us to get some scouts. Yes, get, get more scouts. Scouts. Yes. scouts. Get them out. Get them out. Get those old scouts out. Except, you know, with, with some exceptions. There was some, you know, like the guys that brought in uh, uh, people like uh, Jones. You know, uh, G.J. Jones and uh, uh, people who got um, – our offensive lineman that really should be a a, a center. Um, go ahead. These these kind of players, the players that made sense in this. Yes. Yes. You could keep yes. those guys, but get rid of all the the Gordons and the 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 guys that hi, hired the running back uh, who fumbles the ball all the time. Those guys can go. Yes. Those, Justin those, Simmons, Garrett Holtz, they need to yeah, go. All that. They, these all those guys can go. Get rid of all yes. of them. Yes, we yes we need to start liquidating this. We need to start liquidating the front office in terms of scouts. We need to get scout. I mean, it would surprise Sean Payton. Payton centric. Payton system centric. Yes, yes. Get scout. Yes, yes, yes. Get get scouts in here, whether it's from the Saints or who wherever that have the same vision that you want to do, Sean Payton. None of this fucking bullshit. You need to get players that. System, you've got to know like coach that fucking makes sense. If you look into this guy, it makes a lot of sense. Now let's start doing the building blocks right. You got one down. Let's get the other block on top of that. Yeah, they line. said the fans have to be patient. The fans have to be. We yes, said that yes, too. You gotta be fucking patient. 
We said exactly the same thing. If you're going to do yes, it right, because yes. there's a yes, lot yes. of work. The only problem is that because of so much mismanagement by the trust, their their hand their their hands are almost tied. It's it's just uh, like I said, God. I am, just, so, I am so I am so I am so I happy. Wish, Brid, I just wish so much Bridgewater was still here. The cap we had all that. Oh man. I know. Uh, Could you imagine? And you got to again late. You got to begin yep. somewhere, I guess. I guess this is it. Go ahead. I'm sorry. No, no, you know, I, I'm just, I'm happy to hear them say they're not going to cater to the media. I'm happy that they said they're going to, the, the build, they said that, they said build so many fucking times. It was ridiculous. And on top yeah. of that. Yeah, I'm because so they happy. probably had meetings outside of that trust noise, that noise of, of hired media that they're saying they don't want to cater to. And said, so what the hell do we got to do? Uh, well, Sean Payton said, you, you got you to gotta build this right. You got to do this right. Your offensive line, defensive line really yeah, isn't it. Yeah, and, and, and who was the first hire? Who was the first hire? I just, I just, yeah. And then eventually it'll probably have to re, revamp the defense as well, just down the road. I know everybody thinks it's the top defense, but it's anyway. And exactly. So that, that'll be addressed down the road. But right now, it's one. You know, right now, it's thank God. I mean, finally, finally, there. Oh, finally, yep. I'm still yep. alive to see it. Yep, yep. And one step at a time for me. I'm not getting ahead of myself, too. Just putting yeah. that out there. Yeah, I, this, I'm just, just happy. One step. I'm, I, I, I'm just happy that their first hire was an O-line coach. That makes sense. That's that it. Makes sense. That, <laughs> that makes I, sense. Exactly. Exactly. Now, just let them do their job. Get the scouts all on the same page. This is what I need. These are the kind of guys that work. You know, these are the guys we can develop. These are the diamonds in the rough. We know we can get these guys. We know that they'll be successful in the NFL. Right now, yes. that's the strat. So, yep. I'm, I'm, liquidate yep, players. Exactly. I would say start liquidating some of those, those players that have been around too long and uh, get those contracts on that cap money. And let's, let's, uh, Maybe even trade some for some draft capital. Let's get it done. <laughs> if anybody wants these being players, let's, oh, I know. let's exactly. not get, a, let's, yeah, let's not get ahead of ourselves. Exactly. You know? that, that's, another, that's another story altogether. But, woo, we got Zach Strife, baby. I, I'm happy. I, I'm happy about It's a good first step. That, move. that makes so much fun. Yep, now let's get a belly block on top of that good first step that aligns correctly. Yes. Okay, now, guys, you see when we can get excited. Now we just got to yeah. one step at a time, one step at a time. Okay. Yeah. Let's let, let Roll. the fans out. Yeah. Let's, let's get not get ahead of on. ourselves. Yes. Not get ahead of ourselves. Yes. All right. right. I'll let you go. All right. Have a, safe, have a safe journey. I'll try to. All right. Well, watch out for the crazies on the road. Oh yeah. We'll do. Bye. Bye.